nuts out. Now you can untwist it right here. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for stopping in today. We got a package here from TexChoiceTools.com. I ordered this from them. I'm going to demonstrate. I'm going to show you what it is, and I'm going to demonstrate you how to use it and why exactly you need to be using this thing. This is the M18 inflator, and this thing is outstanding. And I'm going to show you guys exactly why I need this, and realistically why you guys need this. For $209, you get the Milwaukee tire inflator and also a 5.0 chemical battery resistant battery. This alone is $189 by itself. So for $109, for $209, you get the tire inflator and this chemical resistant battery. It's a 5.0. It's an outstanding deal. Again, this is from TextChoiceTools.com. You guys know as I re know, I recently stumbled upon them and I'm very happy I found them because this is awesome to have. Plug it in, haven't read the instructions, don't know exactly what to do. So you guys are gonna find out here right with me. You can go ahead, I do believe, set your PSI. You can have it remember that PSI. You have four settings, so memory one, memory two, memory three, memory four, which is pretty sweet. Um, 30 PSI. It's that simple. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you exactly why I need this and why you need this right now. Take a look here. I have my wife's minivan, the LB7, the LBZ, camper, my lawnmower, snowblower, and the forerunner right here, which you can see has some flat tires. Now before you fill your tires up with air, make sure you check inside the door here. They're usually on the newer vehicles, not on these older vehicles typically, um, but on the inside of the door is gonna be your PSI of what you need for your vehicle. And so make sure you do that so that you fill your tires to the right price. Now since this is an older vehicle, I'm just gonna go off of what the tire recommends. The tire recommends a maximum of 44, so I'm just gonna go ahead and put it at 42 PSI. Now I'm actually gonna go ahead and put this in my memory one bank because these tires on this Forerunner are always leaking. So until I get that fixed, it'll be nice to have this and I can just go hit memory one and it'll be at my 42 PSI. Now the nice thing about this is it has this um, adapter right here for twisting on. It makes it very, very simple for twisting on tires. You're gonna go ahead and simply take your cap off, twist this on, and go ahead and hit the button. And just like that, it automatically caught out. Now you can untwist it right here. Put your cap on, turn your machine off, and if that's the only tire you have to do, you're good to go. Now I will say they do make this really cool adapter that goes on this. It's called a lock and flake. They sell it on their on Text Choice Tools website. I would highly recommend buying it. I didn't personally get it, and I already at this moment wish I did because I need to do the rear tire as well, and I do have a flat um, on my snowblower that I'm going to take care of right away right now. So I really wish I would have got that because you basically click it on there, you walk away, and you can click it off, and you can click it on the next one. It's really really simple, you guys. Again, I got this the five. Chemical resistant battery and the tire inflator for $209 from TextChoiceTools.com. I highly recommend it. Whether you're an off-roader or a guy like me that just has a lot of vehicles, a lot of tires, a lot of things to maintain, I got a youth ATV as well. This type of thing is outstanding to have and realistically gets rid of all those stupid little compressors that are annoying to keep around and it's just kind of a pain. You got to plug them in and all this kind of stuff. Run extension cords. You don't have to do that with this. I highly, highly suggest you guys. This is honestly one of the best purchases I've made in a long time. Again, TextChoiceTools.com, I highly suggest it. And realistically, if you're an off-roader, you absolutely need this, you guys. To have this on your vehicle while you're off-roading, when you deflate, de deflate your tires, and to simply use something like that to inflate them, you need to have it, trust me. On any shop trailer, on any job site, on any off-road vehicle, this is an absolute must now. I'm honestly, I'm dead serious. I'm very excited if you can't tell. So like the video, subscribe to the channel. I hope you enjoyed this because man, when I get something cool like this, I gotta share it with you guys. Have yourselves a great night. All right, so one thing I forgot to mention here real quick is while you've got it in there, so I'm at 40.5 right now, let's go ahead and get this back tire. Uh, 42. All right, so we're up a little bit, 42 right there. Now this thing can actually monitor how much you're dropping. If you wanna take, if you wanna take air out of your tires, this can actually monitor that. Simply loosen this up, and now you can actually watch how much air you're taking out of your tires. It's actually really, really cool to be able to do that. But I don't wanna do that, so we're gonna go ahead and get this back on. Perfect. 
Again, I highly suggest that lock inflate for this so that way you don't lose any air when you take that off like that. One more time, textchoicetools.com. Big fan of them, you guys. I'm glad I found them. And of course, the link will be in the description for you guys. Have a great night.